the maxillary right first molar, the buccal aspect. We start to do the horizontal line, which is 0.5 millimeter from the end of the paper, and the vertical line. Okay, and A he is the starting point of our drawing. From A to B, 7 millimeters, which represent the crown length. From B to C, uh, 12 millimeters for the buccal roots and 13 millimeters for the lingual root, which is uh, longer. All three roots can appear from this aspect. The first measurement is the mesiodistal dimension at cervix, which is 8 millimeters. It is 1 millimeter from B, uh, 4 millimeters uh, toward the mesial surface, and 4 millimeters toward the distal surface. And then the mesiodistal dimension at contact area, which is 10 millimeters. The level mesially at the junction between the uh, occlusal and middle third, which is 2.3 millimeters nearly. It will be 5 millimeters toward the mesial surface and 5 millimeters toward the distal surface. Uh, the location of the contact area at the center of the middle third or the center of the crown. It is about 3.5 millimeters from A. Uh, the outline. The outline is the cervical line, which is uh, slightly convex. The mesial outline from the cervix to the crest is almost straight, while the distal outline is convex. Now we will try to define the cusps, cusp tips. We have two cusp. Uh, uh, we have two cusps uh, from this aspect, the buccal aspect, which is the mesial buccal cusp and the distal buccal cusp. To define the cusp tip and then draw the slopes. أول شيء نسوي إنه from the contact area ننزل two dotted lines, okay here one and the second one, and then mesially we will move three millimeters from the dotted line toward the center of the tooth and two point five millimeters from the distal aspect. We need also three third point اللي هي تقريبا اللفة المارتها نصعد من A one millimeter and then moving zero point five millimeter. Toward the distal aspect. بهذه الطريقة راح يصير عندي مجيو بقل كاسب slightly larger than the distal بقل كاسب. عندنا ال slopes. Every cusp have two slopes: the mesial slope and distal slope for each cusp. بالنسبة لي ال mesial slope of the mesial بقل كاسب راح يكون يلتقي ويا distal slope at obtuse angle, which is one ten centigrade. While well, the mesial slope of the distal buccal cusp meet the distal slope at a right angle, tend to be more sharper. Uh, from this point, we can draw the buccal developmental groove, which is one of the characteristic features that are available at the buccal aspect, will extend to the center of the crown. From this aspect, we can see uh, the two cusps and also we can see the tip of the mesiolingual cusp, which is longer. For that reason, from the beginning, we start to do or left 0.5 millimeters because we need it now. Uh, the palatal cusps longer than the buccal one. فنحتاج إنه ننزل. لأن ما إذا قصيناها هذه راح نخسر إنه راح ال ال ما نقدر نشوفه from this aspect the lingual cusps. How to define the location of the uh, lingual cusp? And it حرك من a 0.5 millimeters toward the mesial and then 0.5 millimeters. So, downwards. But it had the nocta when had it the two slopes of the mesial lingual cusp. The roots we can see, as I said, three roots from this aspect, and the forcation area is four millimeter from B. Uh, drawing of the roots, it can within the confine of the crown. It can tapered with rounded end. We can the palatal one one millimeter longer than the buccal roots. أهم نقطة نحاول نركز عليها بأنه when you try to do carving never touch this area لأنه إذا سويت هنا V shape cut راح تخسر الأكلوز الأسبكت and you can never and ever can do proper carving أكلوزالي فكل اللي مطلوب من عندك أنه تقص تسوي الميجل أوتلاين والدستل أوتلاين مثل ما تشوف هنا بهذا الفيجر بعد ما رسمنا وحددنا الكراون 
اوكي وبعد ما حددنا الكونتاكت اريا السيرفيكال لاين كونتاكت اريا هنا راح تكون الكونتاكت اريا ميجالي ات ذا جانكشن بيتوين ذا اوكلوزال اند ميدل ثيرد والديستالي راح تكون هاير تكون ات ذا سنتر اوف ذا كراون وايضا حددنا البكل ديفلوبمنتال جروف تقدر تسوي سلايت كارفينج تتعلم بيه اللوبس هذه طبعا مطلوبه بالفينشينج نوت ات ذس ستيج بس ممكن انه هو تقدر تسويها بهذه الستيج اف يو اف يو وونت اهم شيء اشوفه بهذا الاسبكت اشوف الكونتاكت اريا واشوف الاوت لاينز مثل ما رسمناها ما مطلوب من عندك انه تقص هذا الفي شيب في شيب كات بحيث يبين بالاكلوزال از يو سي ناو نيفر تاشت هذا هو البكل اسبكت مثل ما نريده منك او ميجال اسبكت لونجوال اسبكت اند ذا ديستال اسبكت